Len Rumney here in Cardiff, Wales. And uh, we just had Marty Breeze come and be a part of uh, a two-day event that we've had here at, at our church, and it has just been phenomenal. We're very grateful how the Lord wove the events together for him to be able to be here. And, uh, and then what we found is that one, as a pastor, finding a man who's just filled with the Spirit, and just humble and able then just to minister God's grace and song, spontaneity, and, and just, and it was a real, there was the Holy Spirit just drew really near in the midst of all that was being ministered. And some of the truths in his songs were just, were really poignant, and it really affected everyone that was here. And so, again, with, with really a whole heart, I can fully and, and, and with gladness just say, you know, Marty Breeze is as a real brother and a real, um, uh, and a real prophet, I suppose. Yeah, a real prophet in the ministry, in song, and so uh, uh, we just commend him to school. You. And we just invited all our students and staff to come along and just see what would happen. And it was great because we had over 200 young people that have been here in our theatre. They've listened to Marty and they've heard his music, and it was so powerful for them to experience something that was just so different. From, from, from what they usually experience. <laughs> and I work with Teen Challenge in um, England, in Bournemouth, and we work with people in, with life control and addictions and homelessness, and we had the absolute joy and honour of having Marty Breeze come and speak at our outreach, sing and speak, and what an absolutely amazing time that was. Marty's a man that has an anointing and a calling of God on his life. And that was so evident there, and so many of these people in the most broken situations and were touched by the Holy Spirit. Marty shared about the love of Jesus. He shared about the hope that we can have in God. And you know, that just flowed from him because he experiences it himself. Not because he was speaking from head knowledge, but he was speaking from heart knowledge. He spoke about the God that he knows, and it touched and changed lives that night. And um, he spoke about a man called David from the Bible. And God put a, a sign, as it were, over his life. He said he's a man after God's own heart. And that night I was thinking about Marty, and I thought, that's Marty. Marty Breeze is a man after God's own heart. Where he goes, he takes Jesus. He's the hands and the feet and the voice of Jesus and lives are touched and changed through his ministry. So thanks, Marty. Thanks for coming and we pray you'll continue to be God's voice, hands and feet wherever you go. God bless you both. Bristol Nazarene Church. This morning we've had Marty at the church. Uh, we had him last year and we uh, enjoyed his ministry so much that we invited him back. And it's been a great blessing this morning. Uh, Marty is a really amazing skillful guitarist and his loops are so interesting for the church it's really dynamic soundscape that he brings but also in the very heart of it is this real passion for jesus this real passion for the ministry which um, you know leaks out in all his songs and leaks out in his whole life and marty did a live gig um there where he talked a bit about his faith he he sort of tells stories he played songs and it was great lots and lots of young people came to listen and there was a group of sixth formers who we hadn't really engaged with much in, the, in our normal work in the school who, were, who stayed for the whole concert and were listening to the every word and had a little chat with us afterwards. And so it was a really great and positive time. And yeah, so it was great working with, with Marty, a fantastic bloke, a very humble and um, great guy who's willing to muck in and get involved with all sorts of stuff. And, um, and also just a tremendous musician, gracious person and someone that can just convey truth in a really authentic way accessible and beautiful way and an amazing time for, for residents essentially just to be ministered to by his music he's a, a great musician um, a man who is full of God's spirit and Jesus love is just oozing uh, through him and as he shared his story and his life uh, with the clients there like they were just so touched and, and blessed by the event um, and after there was an opportunity for, for ministry and, and a number of our clients who have been through all sorts of background, many street homeless, drug addiction, alcohol problems in the past, 
Um, and he was ministering to them with, with his team and just those opportunities to then carry those relationships forward and in, invest in them um, was, it, it was just an overall great event and, and God really used that to, to bring about his kingdom within uh, the work in the wine. So Marty came and shared uh, with this small group the gospel about Jesus and some of his incredible songs and guitar playing. We really enjoyed it. And uh, five people stood at the end to respond to the gospel, saying they want a relationship with Jesus, which is obviously really exciting for us. He has ministered to us in song ministration and in word and has encouraged us so much. It is amazing how God is using him in his ministry and how he touches the hearts of people when he ministers. Uh, and it's been wonderful, and, um, but also really, really moving. That mix of prophetic word with uh, lived experience, uh, with sort of heartfelt humanity, it's been really, really powerful and really encouraging. And we've been in the secondary school this afternoon, and it was really, really brilliant. with a small group of youngsters, but they really listened. They enjoyed Marty's playing, and uh, so did we, of course. And God was really at work um, through Marty.